Hello, Shadowcat back with more Guild Wars 2. Yes, and I'm Blizzard Star, and last time we got to, um... We met the Empress. We did? Yes. And other people. We, and we were given the go-ahead to help clear out the Aetherblades, because we but, have vested interest. But more importantly, we met the Empress. We did meet the Empress, yes. I mean, we can chalk that off on our list. We met a Queen, we met an Empress... Now we just need to... Well, no, we met a god. Yeah. Let's see. What else have we met? Um, have we met a princess yet? Uh, not as of yet. No. And then there's whatever Kreisha is. That's true. I don't know. We've met pretty much every... Now that I think about it, let's see. We met Queen Jenna. Mm -hmm. uh, we met Newt White Bear. Yep. We met Bangar. We, we killed. The, we, we killed Bangar. We killed Bangar. We met Krisha. We, we met, met the Pale Tree. We met the Arcane Council. Yep. Once. At least, well, one of the Arcane Council. No, no, no. Um, when um, we were trying to track down all the 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 dragon spawn that Primordius was leeching into the world, we met right. the Arcane Council. Okay, fair enough. Now, we met Snap a bunch of times. Yeah. Still want to punt the run. <laughs> no, we've met a lot of people. You mean Snap? Uh, you mean Flunt? Punt the Flunt? Snap is, uh, was part of the old, um, Dragon's Watch. Oh no, you're right. <gasps> I feel so bad. No, you're right. It was absolutely Flunt. You, you just said to punt Zoja's, uh, mentor. Don't tell Zoja. It might tell Soja. Don't tell Soja. I wonder how she's doing anyway. We haven't heard from her in know. a long time. Well, she did kind of get hurt in the blight pod, so... Ugh. Yeah, she kind of got slurped and cloned and... Yeah. yeah bad, bad times. Anyway, bad time. um... We're supposed to be actually working right now. Yeah, we should. We so, have to go talk to Rama. Yeah, so we're supposed to be um, talking with Rama. He's got yeah. case files, yeah. or a case file at least, on the Aether Blades. And so... And let's go and uh, snoop around his office, shall we? That's not really he's snooping. Good. We literally have permission. Well, he's still not going to be uh, thrilled about it. Um, Quite the contrary. I don't think he cares. Mm, we'll see. His aide is not happy about this because she's got to stay late for us. <laughs> right. But I mean, otherwise, I don't think I don't think he really cares. Maybe. Again, the structures are gorgeous. This place is definitely different. So pretty. Are those fit? Is that a fish? That's a fish. That's a yes. fish. I guess I never heard of handrails. Instead, we get fish. It's decorative. I can tell it's decorative. Everything around here seems decorative. Except that for that guy. Thing? Which almost stepped on me. You can't just put new soap in the bathroom. It needs Hi. the planning committee's approval. Hi, Connie. Connie. Yes. Detective Rama gave me permission to be here. Okay, yeah, that's totally interesting. I'm gonna dig through your archives. In the back, knock yourself out. Ooh, I'll be keeping a close eye on you. She's not gonna be keeping a close eye on us. No, she doesn't care. I don't know, so there's a book here. There is a book here, what's this? Hey. Have you ever been to the new high ranking Canaan? member of the it's Pierce like criminal organization? So much more to operate out of New Canaan City. He's been involved in several acts of domestic terrorism. He might have ties to powerful people within Catholic government and private sector. Current status? Unsolved. Signee, Captain Min, East Precinct. Domestic terrorism. All right. I don't know what these purists are, but we might want to keep tabs on that. Yeah, probably a good idea. What's this? Hey, what do you think of Minister Lake? A report totally filed by Detective Rama. Right? 
the detective investigated witness sightings at the eastern wilds of the suspected members of the purists. Again, it's those guys. Mm -hmm. A group identified by New Caning Security Division as a potential, potentially dangerous entity. Report has been reviewed by Minister Lee Ha Yung and has been closed for the following reasons. Insufficient evidence, actions unenforceable. Well, that's too bad. All right. Well, what else we got? What's on? What's over here? Is that a stick? It's like a stick. Oh no, it's, it's a scroll. scroll. Remember, incidents of violent crime have increased one thousand seven hundred thirty percent. We continue to deal with the presence of mainland Terran criminals. Situation is under control, but Mr. Lee has filed a request with the Imperial Court for fifteen million gold budgetary increase for the next quarter. This quest is still pending approval. A slight uptick in dragon, dragon jade malfunction complaints. 17 dangerous incidents reporting during this quarter. Okay, I only have like 12 gold. Right. So like, um, if I ever see 15 million, it's going to be maybe 14 million by the time I walk away. <laughs> What's Got this? what you needed? Notice to all employees, personal reading material of salacious nature is not suitable for the workplace environment. Signed, Senior Office Administrator Chang Lihua. Also here here on Madam June, files are so surveillance old order and signed by Mr. Li Hun Un. Madam June is the owner of Shulin Jade, known as Shulin Guild. That's Zun Lai, actually. And I remember them. If you read your history, which I realize you in the Blood Legion probably ate your history. We did. Um, the Zun Lai used to be a guild that operated across Tyria. Oh. Yeah. That's cool. There's scant left of them now, but they used to be really big. Oh. She shares a blood relation to the current Emperor of Cantha, Empress Ill. The valuation of the Zun Lai Jade's assets are estimated to be about 3 billion gold across all holdings in... Shinjia, New Kainan, and the Jade Sea. The company was investigated last year for illegal dumping and dangerous or hazardous materials in the Aga Vault. The case was closed when Madame June settled with the Imperial Court for undisclosed amount. Neither June nor Julian Jade have been officially indicted with any charges. Soon lie, and three billion gold. Yep. That's um. Cog something. Huh? Yeah. The Aether Blades must be marking their territory. Uh-huh. Hmm. So investigation of foreign pirate activity, that'd be the Aether Blades, yep. has thus far encompassed Xingjia Island. We're unable to ascertain the location of their hideout, but concerned citizens have reported sightings of suspicious markings. The common description seems to be of a cog or skull with a sword in the foreground. This may be some form of communication for the criminals of this organization. Sketches of these markings have been sent to the Ministry of Intelligence for analysis. They have yeah. intelligence? I guess so. Do we care, we care about the... Oh. So, anything else we could read is gone. Yeah, we don't need to worry about that anyway. Okay. Check the chest. Did I leave anything behind? No, I did not. I was very thorough. I made sure to grab everything of yours. Okay, just making sure. <clears throat> uh, I think we're done here. Thank you. Not what I needed, I think. Thanks for your help, Akane. Mm. Woman of few worlds. Oh, words. I like it. <laughs> Straight to the point. Okay. Or she just wants us out of the hey, office. Bye. Hey, Commander. You should probably head to the crash site soon. Gorik's getting a bit breathless. Between us, I think he's taking the Anka situation pretty hard. She did betray his trust and kidnap him. Just gives us more incentive to track her down. Ah, still, I hate seeing him like this. Figured I'd let him blow off steam. Listen, if he feels like talking. About Anka, anyway. Can't follow his science rants for the life of me. You're a good friend, Jory. We'll make sure she gets what's coming to her. See you too soon. <laughs> okay. To the crash site, then. Apparently. That's going to be a bit of a walk. 
Yeah, it is. So, how about we not do that? What is your uh, idea? I don't know. Look up. Metal! Alright, come on, bronze. I mean, come on. Why do we have them if not for this exact purpose? That's a very good point. Alright, here we go. Come on, up! We'll find a good launch point up here. There we go. Perfect. All right. Away we go. To the launch site. Or the crash site, you mean? To the unlaunch site. <laughs> All right. It's somewhere around here. Yeah, maybe somewhere around that giant crashed airship. Look left. No, your other left. Oh, interesting. Well, I found Marjorie. Oh, okay. Hold on. I'm coming. I guess I got a little ahead of myself. You did. Hi, Marjorie. Marjorie. Thanks to our busy friends at the Ministry of Security, we won't have any extra help. But I'm sure we'll manage. We'll start looking around up front here. Commander, why don't you check out the wreckage? We can sink after. If I so much as smell one of those aerial degenerates, I'm showing no mercy. And neither should you, Commander. A little Ooh. bit fired up, is he? Feisty. <laughs> I like it. I say we give him a knife and set him loose. I don't think Goro could actually handle himself. Let's be fair. I they think with good. enough motivation, anyone can handle themselves. And he does seem properly motivated. Oh, fair enough. But he's the thinky type, not the dewy type. Yes. Which means that he's thought about all the different ways to hurt them. Oh. You seem to believe that just because we thinky types, as you call it, aren't as tough, that we can't be just as vicious. Because you're not. All right. I don't know what we're doing here, but you know what? There's Aether Blades here, and we may as well. We might as well. Swift Let's try out some of these new spells I've got. I mean, we'll try them out a little bit. Right. But using a hammer as a focus is a little bit weird. Oh, well, when you started with a pistol, you just kind of progress. To a hammer? To a hammer. I feel like a hammer is kind of like the opposite of progression. <laughs> well, you and I have different opinions of progression. Yeah, we do. Sirs, madams, and others, I thought you all should know you're trespassing on... Monastery property, which is a violation of Penal Code 77-65-A. Now, I'm going to give you one last chance to pack your things and vacate, or I'm going to have to take you in. Right. I don't think they care. I mean, I admire his moxie. See, I wasn't scared before, but now... Blades, show this kind officer what we think about being taken in. I'm uh, going to like being caged. All right, Kira. Let's practice what we've been practicing. Or with, let's use what we've practiced. My pet needs help. On one. I chose you. This seems a bit weird. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. I can't do Thank this you. alone. I need somebody to be my meat shield. Alright, time to get my boat. Does that help? No, you don't. I'll be get. Watch my back. Thank you. I'll okay. 
This is a tougher fight than I thought. That's all right, though. So we have water for. Water's good. We like water. Need healing. Okay, but I don't understand how this magic works, so learning as we're going. Nope, that's not it. Up you get. Thank you. On the mend. Okay. Soothing mist. I don't think we're really hurting her. Maybe not. You know what? Maybe we should uh, take a lesson from the Ministry on this one. Should we do a tactical retreat? Dive! Sounds good to me. Dive indeed. Huh. That oh. worked out well. What did we find? I don't know. So Scarlet got this plan. Join up with the inquest. Get me on the captain's council. It's big. I was worried about working for someone else. I never took orders well. But Scarlet, she knows what she wants. Knows how to get it. No fear, no hesitation. It makes sense. If you want to shake the foundations of the world, you can't be scared of falling rubble. I'm sorry, did she just say Scarlet? Yeah, that was my trend. You've got to be kidding me. We are still dealing with fallout from Scarlet. Yep. I mean, I don't know if I should be surprised given that they're Aether Blades, but... I thought we were done with Scarlet. I killed Scarlet. You did. You stabbed her in the chest. Okay, nobody tell rocks. Uh, rocks would have choice words, I'm sure. Yeah, well, given that she was already upset enough that she didn't kill, um, kill Scarlet herself. Yeah. I need to get back up there. Oh, shocky. Very much so. Making my first stand on end. I don't like it. I'll oh! Right back. She remembered us! I don't think she's impressed with us. No, she's not. I wonder if we can get into this thing. I wonder what this is. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know we can't use it. Ooh! Run away! How do we get inside this thing? Because I bet there's something inside. Probably. I don't see an entrance, do you? No, not at all. Well, you're not being helpful. Oh! I think um, what we're looking for is on the bow of the ship. Hoorah! <sighs> Oh, it is. Portal's offline. Hull's compromised. Oh, Missing God. about a hundred unique parts, and that's just us. Other ships in the fleet are just as bad. Captain! Oh. Captain! Scarlet's dead. And the commando... You killed her, I know, I don't care. Out! Oh. Captain, pull Endurance. yourself together. The crew can't be like this. Scarlet was supposed to... Captain, you have maybe ten seconds before the crew sees you like this and loses all respect for you. We're trapped in the mists, and they need a leader. So, lead. You're right. Organize the crew. We start working to fix this right now. Okay, well. I mean, good luck fixing that. Right? Me. I'm going to start trying to fix myself before I end up putting myself in a hole. Good idea. Come on. I can handle you guys, right? 
I'm in bad shape. Hopefully. Gotcha. Okay. Ooh. I still feel like we need to get inside of there, but I just don't know how. Yeah. Back to it. This place is crawling Anger with aether rising. blades. Well, the more aether blades we can squish them. Come, Phoenix. Cool. Yeah, Jade Hologram Technology. Feel the pain. It's super fancy. Does it have a damage output then? Uh, a little bit. Oh. It's not great. No, this hammer has slots for things called Jade Spheres. That's oh. interesting. Mm -hmm. Okay. Boop the box. I know where you're going with that, and the answer is no. We have no other choice. How else do we get the part? Mm -hmm. How? Uh, what you're saying is we travel through the fractals in the mists, find our past selves, and steal from them? That's not possible. And even if it were, wouldn't we just be screwing up our own pasts? <sighs> They're fractals. Echoes of pure potentiality. Our own pasts are secure. We just be exploring the alternative. Fractals are inherently unstable. We can't waltz around the mists wherever we please, like it's the South Sun Cove. We would have to travel to dozens of fractals, stable fractals. Hundreds for the right parts. Depends how far back we go, what versions of our ships we're plundering. And you're okay with this? Fighting, maybe killing yourselves hundreds of times over? I ask again. How else do we get the part? Hey, Jory. I found a few recordings, but no leads. <laughs> Who knew pirates had so much drama? Tell me about it. Just keep looking. Think we I might be on to something. Gorik, calm down. I'll call you back. See, I'm telling you, we give him a knife and cut him loose. Uh, he's a little bit upset. And you dropped into the wrong place. At the wrong time. Feel the pain. Didn't know the Pipsqueak had so much suspiciousness uh, suspiciousness in him. I keep telling you not to underestimate those brainy types. Hmm. Huh, what's this? Oh, you're gonna stop me from looking at this thing, aren't you? Yes, probably. Well, enjoy this. All right. Boop okay. the box. Boop the box. Everyone all right? Down go. One ship unaccounted for. Was that Kralkatoric in the mists? What an elder dragon doing in the mists? Huh? What's been going on out here? And where the hell are we? I'm checking. If that's Alona, that's the scum. Cantha. Cantha? <gasps> no. Ivan? You said we'd come out over the crystal desert. I was performing very complex calculations while also being chased by an elder dragon. So cut me some slack. Calm down, everyone. Anka, Ivan, see if you can get in touch with the other ships. Renyak, gather our supplies. I guess we're about to find out how Kanth has changed in the last 200 years. Huh. Sounds like I've been here before. Right? Huh. Yeah, you're you're not gonna let us go, are you? Probably not. Because 
that would be too easy. It would be too easy. Unfortunately for you, this is not going to end well for you. Come salt spray. I'll break you down. How do you know all these mythical creatures if we've never seen them before? Because I didn't eat my books. <laughs> salt spray dragons were a thing back during the Tyrian Guild Wars. Why do you why do you have any reason to enjoy human history? Because those who don't learn from history are often doomed to repeat it. Besides, it's wise to know what mistakes previous Char made so we don't repeat those. I mean, I guess so. The box. Boop the box. Full disclosure, I'm now recording this conversation. For posterity. And let the record show that Ivan does not like what First Mate Anka is insinuating. Not one bit. Relax, mole face. I'm not insinuating anything. Even an obsequious brown-nosing bootlicker like Ivan must have noticed how much time the captain's been spending among the campus. She's in it. What do you call it? Uh, casing the place. But the crew's getting restless. We should be ransacking the locals, dare I say, even committing a little bit of piracy. Instead, we're hiding in these ruins up to our ears in seawater and hungry risen. We're not hiding. We're strategizing. You want to pillage the most technologically advanced civilization on Tyria without a plan? The captain's got a connection in Cantha. That's our inn. We do a couple of jobs for this canton, earn some trust, and then we make our move. Sounds ominous. Risen? Yep, I guess they got uh, all the way over here. Zaitan's but, been busy. But how? Zaitan is gone. Zaitan has been gone for a long time. Yeah, but just because he's gone doesn't mean all of his minions are. I think I... I see something down there. Boop! I can do that too, you know. I did it first. Anger rising. Come salt spray. And everyone take a seat. Right? Oh, granting me oh, these the wings has been a nice touch. I appreciate them. Eh, they do look nice. All right. Boop the box. Boop the box. They explain this to me again. She needs a kind of dragon expert. She has every possible resource in Kampa at her disposal. Why does she need us to find her a dragon expert? Apparently, they're in short supply, so she needs us to... Import one. Mm, a dragon, I could. Yeah. I was thinking you could go to Radisson. Maybe ask. I know someone. What? I know someone. I think they'd be willing to come? No question. I know exactly what he wants to hear. Commander, need you ASAP. We may have just found our lead. I'll take that. Hey, know how long it took to find that thing? Okay, remember what I said about him being feisty? Yeah. He might be a little bit too feisty. <laughs> okay, so Anka lured him. Yeah. Well, we knew that. Yeah. I think I'm scared of you. Some little rat thing with pointy hands. Well, hello, Commander. Say, didn't you just beat this gentleman's friends to a pulp? Yeah, looks like I forgot one. We found him roaming around out here. Seems he was piecing this together. I recall Blish using similar components in his portal research. Appears to be a tool for mistraversal. Shame if we accidentally dropped it off a scenic overlook. And I hear the mists are lovely this time of year, too. Careful with that. We need... 
Fine. What do you want? Make it quick. Unka cited a professional interest in Elder Dragon research, namely Aurene. Care to elaborate? You're asking the wrong guy. Anka does the dragon stuff. And maybe my train? Who knows anymore? Sounds a bit uncertain. <laughs> Cause it doesn't matter. There's better things coming. Big plans. The Jade Winds are a changing. Care to elaborate on these big plans, Air Fiend? <laughs> Rude to my associate and off topic. Commander, would you teach this bozo some manners? So, um, we're in Cantha. Yep. Can you find me some bamboo? Oh, I like how we think. Because <laughs> uh, bamboo has lots of potential. Bamboo has lots of potential. Do you hear me? What are you going to do? Let's break his kneecaps. Good thing my knuckles healed from smashing all those aether blade skulls. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No need to get violent. I don't know what the plans are, okay? Just heard some higher-ups mention it. Look, I fix stuff. Clean the galley. Might run a few errands. Nobody's telling me nothing. Gods, we're beating up the maintenance guy? This isn't helping anything. Ugh, let him go. Can you just give it back? Yeah! Korik! Damn it! What'd you do that for, you little dweeb? Seems to have gotten stuck in these pointy hands. I could probably repair it quite easily, but I have work to do. Commander, I'm at Orbean's cave. You need to get over here. Like, right now! I'm on my way. Ah, it's one thing after another. It really is. Marjorie? How you doing, Marjorie? I guess we got a lead out of him. A little cryptic, but... I can work with it. I've never felt so alive! Now I know how the mantis feels as it closes in on its prey. Take it easy, tough guy. That was pretty badass. But there is a certain finesse to this job. We'll practice. You can try being good cop next time. That's, that's a good place for him to start. Yes, it really is. Okay, we gotta get to Aurene. Yeah, see what she needs. You know, now would be a really good time for one of those boats. It really would be. All right, metal. Bronze. To Orene. To Orene. Ugh, Alchemy, you're here. What's going on, Tiny? I don't know. Orene and Kate, they're... They're fine. June, what are you doing here? I told you my jade tech can help your dragon. So that's what I'm doing. Helping. We were talking to Orene when she went quiet all of a sudden. It's like she's sleeping. But not. I thought it could be a concussion from the fall. But then Kate... Uh, she fell silent too, while still standing. I don't know if she's being affected because of their connection or what. All my tests show Orene's magic levels are steadily improving. Perhaps the extractor caused lingering side effects. Maybe, but it's impossible. Hello? 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 Commander? Commander? Over here. Keith? Hi, Keith. Keith, where are we? Shh. They're talking. They're, talking. They're not just mortals. They're my friends. They're your flock. The shepherd watches and protects. But she does so in solitude. When I created the others, I thought, I don't have to be alone anymore. The other elder dragons? You were there. Hmm. I was imperfect, you see. Attuned to water, but not the other elements. I thought my children would bring balance and harmony to the fabric of magic, but... Then, what happens now, Suan? Now, you take my place, little one. Consider what I've said. Looks like they're coming around. 
Oh, good. I thought it was contagious. What just happened? That was the first Elder Dragon. The mother of all dragons. Isn't that right, Aurene? Kralkatorix. Mother. My great-grandmother. What? what? We'd spoken before. A few times. I didn't know who she was until we came here. What does she want? For me. To take her place. Take her place? And become... The one... Elder Dragon. The last Elder Dragon who wanted something from you was Jormag. And we know how that turned out. Su Wong isn't Jormag. Can we be sure? You can. Su Wong's been Kantha's guardian since the Zaitan disaster. Or so goes the legend. I need some time to think about this. Of course. In the meantime, we still have to find the Aether Blades. And whatever that extractor thing is, how did they get their hands on something capable of doing this? Anka was a brilliant machinist, and that weapon was a Sura made, but the technology's beyond even the inquest. That's because it's Canthan. I gave it to my Trin. You hired them, didn't you? I did. You! You hired them? This is all because of- I didn't know what they were capable of, or their history in Tyria. If I did, I never would have... I'm sure you have questions. Ask me anything. We might have one or two. Have yes. You? I'm going to think it's interesting to be transparent here. Okay, Is so what? you're working with my trip. She was working for me. She's got Canthan ancestry, so she could walk among us. My guards caught her snooping around one of my power plants. She'd hacked my security system. I could have made her disappear. No one knew who she was, after all. But I was impressed at her resourcefulness, so I told her to come work for me. I need people who can find my blind spots, and I took a liking to her. She became my protege. Bit of a slow learner, but she worked her ass off. Whenever I tried explaining Jade Thama dynamics, she struggled. But somehow she always figured it out. I could never put my finger on it. That woman was haunted by something. Maybe all the people she killed at Lion's Arch. Maybe. So, oh. why did you hire them then? I needed yeah. dragon research. As you're acutely aware, the dragon cycle threatens us all. And it turns out the best dragon researchers exist outside of Cantha. Mm-hmm. She's got a point there. The Aether Blades could go <laughs> where I couldn't. That's why I needed Mai and her crew. I never asked them to kidnap anyone. I wanted to import talented researchers with their consent. Uh-huh. So then... How did they get here, anyway? Uh, that's a good question. Apparently, they came out of the mists. They were lucky to have landed in the ruins of old Kaining and not... Well, you saw what happened when you dropped in on Xingjie? Yeah. Yeah, we did. We were, um, we were there for that. Just a little. Yeah. So you called Su Wan Kantha's protector? Yeah. I suppose it began with the Zaitan disaster. The massive tidal wave of undead that came crashing to our shores. Worst calamity since the Jade Wind. Even a hundred years later, with all our advances, we still feel the effects. Well, Su Wan is the hero of that story. Rising from the depths, turning back the waters and the dead. Poetic stuff. People say she formed a pact with Kunavang to protect Kantha. Salt spray dragon, local, hero in her own right. But, aside from a few rumors here and there, they've hardly been seen since. For Su Wan to reach out to Orin so soon after her arrival, well, it's certainly a fascinating development. Right. Oh, Arine is the great great granddaughter of her, so. And also the of... only dragon left. Yeah, considering so... we kind of dealt with the rest. So. Yeah. So, um. Where is my Trin now? Now, yeah. June, the Aether Blades are planning something big. 
We need to track down my trend before it's too late. I only spoke with Mai, and usually on my turf. They have a number of hideouts across Kantha. In Xingzhe, I'd expect her to be hiding somewhere in Zen Daijun. A cave, if I know her. My sources tell me the Ministry of Security's been looking for her, but somehow she's avoided detection. The Blades are a sneaky bunch, but we've got experience with their bag of tricks. Okay then. Marjorie, Gorik, let's finish this investigation. Let me know when you find my Trin, Commander. Okay. Well then. Well, um, should we step outside? Yeah. Come on, we'll we'll leave them to handle things in here. We need to talk for a second. We do need to talk. All right. Well, I think she's probably right about a cave. The last time we tracked down my Trin, that was back in Lion's Arch, and she and was in, in a cave. cave. Yeah, they were underneath Lion's Arch in a cave. So that just so... leaves Zen Daijun. Do you have yeah. any idea where that is? I have no idea. We should probably have asked June when we were in there, but... Or I we're believe... Smart. I mean, I have a map. Maps are good. Let me just spread my map out on the crystal here. Yeah. Zen Daijun. Zen Daijun. Zendaijun. Mm -hmm. There it is. It's east of Seitung Harbor. Oh, yeah. So there it is. Yeah. It looks like there's a road that leads from Seitung straight into that structure in Zendaijun. From there. Hopefully we can find them. It shouldn't be that hard, honestly. A cave yeah. is a cave. Cave is a cave is a cave, yep. Pretty much. So, my Trin again. Maybe we'll stop her for for uh, once, finally. Well, this time she's not going in. Like, if we catch her, this time we kill her. Fair enough. Well, I'm right. okay with that. No, no, more, no, more, no more of these second chances. Yeah. All right, but that's going to have to wait until next time. So, if you want to see what happens when we finally reunite with my Trin after all this time... Make sure that you subscribe to the channel, hit the bell icon, that way you get notified every time these videos come out. And give us a big old thumbs up if you were interested just as much as we are with um, Irene talking with her great-great-grandmother, Suwon. Yeah, that was weird. It was very weird. Otherwise, though, if you know anybody else who might enjoy this, don't forget to share this out with them. And if you like what we're doing, leave a comment down below. So, do that, and we will see you next time for more Guild Wars 2. And until then, take care. See you next time. Bye.